Oh, man, that Amy. What a velvet peach. Can I help you? I, I, I doubt it. You're not perv, I hope. The P is silent and is pronounced as an M. As in move it. Sorry, I don't speak Japanese. Um, I'm Larry. A and not my uncle's nephew, as far as you know. I like you, kid. You got spunk. We should hang out sometime and compare our respective philosophies. You know, like two flies drowning in the same bowl of shit. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, you're supposed to have packages for me? Just in case you're planning on slashing these open the second you're out of my sight, there's no porn inside. I already checked. Not my brand, anyway. Find out if he's the mole, dumbass. Oh, do I have to do everything? Say, Merv, how long have you worked here? You wouldn't happen to be a mole by any chance. How long? Let me put it this way. You know the Ten Commandments? They came through my mailroom. That's a long time, idiot. So you've seen a burning bush? There are no redheads working here, asshole. Well, not what I meant, but... Look, kid, don't get me wrong. I hate that dynasty of assholes at the studio across the street. Big anus and little anus. But in their defense, I hate my job. And if they ever tried to bribe me to sabotage your uncle's studio... I'd sign so fast that the motion of my writing hand would cause a tornado in China. Don't mention that to your uncle, okay? <laughs> uh, uh, he he might take uh, take it the wrong way, you know what I mean? <laughs> uh. Oh, sure. So is there anything you could tell me about Kip? Human filth. A huge, rude bag of amphibian shit. Well, you sound like an authority. <sighs> an honor to be working near you, Merv. And I hope when you snap and open fire on the place, you pass me by. Like I'm listening. The executive offices. Just need to drop this off to Uncle Larry and on to Demo. There you go, Unc. Uh, I mean, Mr. Laffer, sir. Wow, kid, you really were born to do menial chores for disinterested executives.
Damone, it's me, Larry. Uh, your mail's here. And by that I mean M-A-I-L, so <laughs> don't get too excited. You're not around. Just had a nooner. Too tired to answer the door. Just leave it. Thanks a bunch, doormat. Reception building. The lovely Jenna likes her packages. I'll just go make my deposit over her. Cooking legs. I got a sweaty package here for you. Maybe you can sign for it with your lips. What do you say, baby? The only thing I want to do to your package, loser, is take a pair of scissors to it. Get bent. Oh, and would you mind not looking at my chest? It makes me feel uncomfortable. Okay, all done. Package is successfully delivered. Now back to the miserable Merv's mailroom. 